Welcome back to Arizona Home Tours. We're at Beacon in Estrella, Estrella Mountain Ranch, that is, in Goodyear, Arizona. This is the Cordova Temporary, Contemporary, not Temporary, Contemporary Farmhouse. We're looking at this model home. I'm also going to show you one that is available, move in, ready. So right when you walk in, you go straight down to the living room, kitchen area, or to the right. We're going to go to the right. So first here you have this office. Now on today's tour, I'm gonna to show you the model and I'm also gonna show you the one that is available. Now they have two that are available, but there's a Cordova farmhouse that is under $490,000. There's one at 482 and one at 488. I believe the backyards are also finished on those homes. And they're like, well, Rich, what's the base price of this home? Hey, I'm glad you asked. And it's right around, for this one, the Contemporary Farmhouse, 430. For the cheapest, the Spanish, the base, is around 425. And there are some incentives available. So if you're like, you know what? I love Stray Mountain Ranch. I love Toll Brothers. I want to be under 490. Then the Cordova might be for you. But I want to show you this model first. That way you can get an idea of what it looks like all dolled up. And then we'll go take a look at what is available and what you actually get. Beautiful tile floor, storage, cabinetry, and I would call this series affordable luxury. And that's kind of what Toll Brothers is known for. Now they have other Toll Brothers homes uh, here in the valley that are, you know, two, three million dollars or more. And I've been in some that are 400, a little less. So it really it depends on what you're looking for and your budget. I just want to give you another kind of look at this island, dining and living. So we're going to touch back in the living room here in a second. I want to pop right into the laundry. Not a ton of storage. You got three cabinets upper, two below with a sink. Dark hardware handles. Here is living space. Plenty of room here. Now this home is a little under 1,700 square feet. It feels larger just because of how open it is. Good size primary bedroom. You have a sliding barn door for your primary bath. Step on into the shower, just tiled floor to ceiling. Nice window as well. And the built-in. And here is your walk-in closet. Plenty of space in here too. And if you want more info on Australia Mountain Ranch, you can reach out to me. I have another video where I covered uh, just that. So I'm happy to share that with you. Let's go on outside. So that's what this backyard looks like. And don't leave yet, because we are going to go look at an available, not model, home in the same floor plan. So here's what it looks like in the model. Now let's go check out the available one. All right, so this is the Cordova Modern. And right now, this one is priced at $482,995. Get out of the sun a little bit. So this is not a model home. This is one that is done and they've done, they've completed the backyard. So let me go in and go straight or right. So we're going to take a right. I'm going to keep going right. I'll show you nice tile floor throughout. So here is your first bedroom. Let's give you an idea. I don't know the exact dimensions. Feels like it's 
small. <laughs> 10 by 10, 11 by 11. Could be, in, could be used as an office space, but not huge. Here's your first bathroom. Got your fiberglass surround. Polished fixtures. You have a dual sink. And of course my battery is dying. Always. So here you'll see this at homes that are not uh, above 500 often, not always, where they don't have lights in some of the, the bedrooms. At least it is wired for a fan or some sort of ceiling fixture. And other times you'll have, uh, and I'm sure you have it here too, where one of those switches will control and that's what that one's going to be right there. You can see how they're upside down. So one is going to be hot always and one is not. So the switch will control that upside down outlet there. That's just letting you know that. All right, so let's make our way. Now remember, we just saw the model that was all done up. So you still have Not so close, but nice. You have a backsplash. There is your island. Another floor plan that I really like out here, that is the Chapin. So make sure you watch the next video because I'm gonna be showing you in that video a Chapin that is available for purchase, not a model. And I've been inside that same floor plan in other communities and a lot of my clients love it. And that one is also under 500. But like I said, this one is in the 480s. Here's your laundry. So no upper cabinets, just lower, no utility sink, storage up there. But if you pay attention to the market, you'll, you know that home prices have gone up. Toll Brothers is not inexpensive by any means and they're probably calling yeah they're not i don't think they're calling this a three car but it's two car with storage so that's the one thing if you're not from arizona and you're used to having a basement or, or more storage uh, it's one thing we quickly realized how much stuff we have and how much stuff to get rid of so there's not a lot of storage space, but you don't need a snowblower. <laughs> you don't need snow shovels. And here's your primary bedroom. And if you like this and you want some more specs, let me know. Again, one thing to pay attention on this, no light fixtures in the ceiling. And then here in the bathroom, just one. Two, and it is wired for above sink lighting as well. And then you have your, oops, almost a broken door. Uh, you have your culture marble surround, basic built in, a light above the shower and a window. And then your walk in closet. But it's, it is nice though to see a brand new home with a, a finished backyard so you don't have to just have a dirt pit. And I like that they, they kept the stacking doors. And I'm gonna open these all the way up just so you can get an experience of what that looks like. Super easy. So I'm gonna look back out so it opens all the way up. So a day like today, absolutely beautiful. Love having the doors and windows open. Don't trip. You have a covered patio here, but not a real big backyard. So on the single story homes, you're not gonna have as big of a backyard. 
just depends on a lot. You have a good size side yard over here. You really can't maybe put a dog run, raised garden, but not a ton of real usable space. I guess it depends on what you want to use it for.